Hello, everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install Python and use Python I.O. Uh, this is for the latest version of Python released uh, on December 2023. It's a Python 12. To download Python from Google, search for this download Python. So now you're going to see this download Python here. So I'm going to click on this, and here you can download Python 3.12. So I'm going to click on this. So this is the uh, latest version. For Windows, uh, I'm using Windows, I just download it and I'm gonna go to the download site. So this is the one just to download it. It's, uh, this is Python 3.12.1 and this is the uh, 64 bit version. Uh, I'm gonna click on this executable now. All right, so here, Install now, just click on this install now using this default. All right, setup was successful. I'm gonna close this and now I'm gonna use it. You can use it from the uh, stop button and use idle and type idle. So this is the Python idle, it's in interactive development uh, environment. So I'm going to click on this now. All right, so here we have this idle share and you can type in commands here and this Python statements and welcome to Python. So here, and this to display welcome to Python. And now I'm gonna go to a file. And so I'm gonna have this is the um, um, create a new file here. So this is a new file and let's write some statements in this file. So here's welcome to Python. and type this three times, welcome to Python. Let's change it to this, welcome to computer science. And here, let's say programming is fun. All right, I'm gonna um, execute this Python code here. And there's three statements. Um, so instead of typing all these three statements from the Python shell, I put this in a file. So I'm going to have to uh, save this file uh, before I'm, I'm going to run it. So I'm going to save it as, all right, let's save it as um, somewhere here in my temp. I'm going to save it as test. Okay. And this is the Python file. So this is going to be automatically with the uh, test.py. So I'm going to save it now. Um, so here, okay, it, 
I got into this directory here. Mm. Test. Oh, okay, I already have a directory of tests. Um, let's say here is uh, my first Python. Uh, let's call this is the uh, uh, welcome. All right, save it as welcome now. All right, so this is a set now. This is welcome.py. Uh, it is under this directory here. Uh, it's a C uh, temp. All right, so now I'm gonna run it. Click run and run module. So now you're gonna see this is executed. All right, um, let's go back here now. Is um, um, I'm gonna create another file so you can have a new file at this time. And this new file, let's do this, print uh, one plus two times three is. All right, so I'm gonna write this code here and then print one plus two times three. So this is the string. It's going to display this is a string. And here, this is going to display the result of the expression here, one plus two times three. All right, so now, um, if you say I'm going to run it to run module, it will ask you to save it. So let's see, gonna, I'm going to save it here. Uh, let's just call this is a, this is a compute expression. All right, and save it. So the, the name of the file is called, uh, this is the, uh, this is the welcome.py. And the other one here, I just said, um, all right, I don't see it now, um, but it's right here. You can bring up here. So it's a, it's a compute expression. Okay, it's right here. So there's two uh, windows here, two windows are opened here. So this one and this. All right, so you can close one here and leave this open. Okay, um, this is from the uh, Python idle. If you want to run it from the command prompt, you can go to uh, open a command prompt. So this is command, All right, open a command prompt and now, and go to this directory here, temp. So now you're gonna see there's two files, Python files, compute expression and welcome.py. You can run this using the command Python, uh, welcome.py. So, all right, it says Python is not found. I think it's, it, it probably will work with just py, so executable. So just py, and this will run the Python source code from the uh, command prompt. So I'm gonna try the next one here is compute expression dot py. All right, so this works too. <laughs> All right, that is all for this video. Um, download and install Python and use Python from uh, Python Idle IDE and from the Windows command prompt. Thank you for watching, goodbye.